Ask Reddit by interesting ad 3430. What is your opinion on the Reddit blackout, and should Ask Reddit participate as one of the most active subs? It's important to remember, we are not the customers. Advertisers are the customers and our time and attention is the product. The question is not how people feel about this, but whether they let Reddit know how they feel about this. We'll see. I run ads on Reddit and there are a lot of us paying attention to what will happen to our campaign stats on these dates. Brands will vote with their wallets if they don't see the return they want, and that's largely influenced by Reddit users and their presence on the platform. It'll be interesting to see the data hopefully positive change will come from it. As I learned in another sub, from a question I asked, we, as users, should log out and not even visit Reddit in support of the cause, if you support the cause obviously. I tend to agree that any of it will not lead to any change. Especially just two days. I think a month would be better. But I'm all for it and going to do something rather than nothing. I've seen several, albeit slightly smaller, subs announcing that they're going dark indefinitely until something changes, and forever if need be. I can't imagine a Skreddit will do the same, but I would personally be in favor. Take it all down and leave the bots scrambling to post on 4chan or whatever other shitty social media place accepts them. Take it down and leave it down until Redu capitulates. A two-day boycott isn't going to realistically achieve anything. My only thought is how will we know when we can come back? I mean if I'm not checking Reddit to see. Also my question. I'm a casual Reddit user, so if it'll help the people who do a lot of the work to keep Reddit going, then I'll participate in a blackout for as long as it takes, but how do we know when we can log in again? Deleted. They got rid of polls. I think after a week it will be forgotten and nothing will change from Reddit's side. Two days won't have an impact. Leaving for months will have an impact. Egg same as every other blackout. I don't even remember what the last ones were about. This isn't just something that will be solved by smaller subs going dark. The larger ones including our credit, need to go dark, if there is to be any hope of change, of a unified front. So, yes, I firmly believe there's a need to join in this protest. Our Pix is on board and they are one of the biggest. I am 100% okay with Reddit charging fees to access their API. I am 100% against the amount they are charging. To have a third party access go from $0 to $20 million a year is just asinine. Shut it down. Shut it down forever. Deleted. I honestly never knew there were third party Reddit apps until this protesting started. I guess it's too late to download one and check it out. NAA, I had no idea how much better boost, bacon or if was until all this stuff started trending. I fully switched to boost. Thank you Strice and Effect. The API charges are insane and Ask Reddit should absolutely participate in the blackout. Third party apps are part of the ecosystem and without the M Reddit will lose mobile users due to the inadequacy of their O. App. We really need Ask Reddit to join because it's the most ubiquitous subreddit on the site. Losing Ask Reddit would be a huge blow, and a huge voice to the cause. Deleted. Deleted. Personally I think the blackout is absolutely necessary, and may need to last longer to really get the point across. From what I've read, after previous long blackouts Reddit pretty much said do this again and amp. We'll just replace you with mods who won't, which is why it's two days. There's the possibility that the blackout is repeated, there's obviously also the possibility that it's not despite likely nothing changing, so I guess we'll all see what happens by the end of next week. Personally, at that point I'll be watching Strange New Worlds anyway. Black this Matherpica out. I'm kinda confused as how are the blackouts working? 
like are people somehow unable to post or interact with posts. However I do feel as yes. As I understand it, subs participating in the blackout will go private for the two days, or however long the blackout will last, so you can't see or interact with the posts. Big grain of salt though, I'm really not the most knowledgeable person when it comes to Reddit. It's necessary to make a statement and ask Reddit should lead by example. 100%. This one sub drives more new users to the site than any other RS Reddit is featured constantly on every single other social media platform. I personally am unaffected by the update. The blackout however does bother me in that the people who are affected want to ruin it for everyone else simply because they can't have their way. This is the way of a petulant child, and I feel that if this update is so terrible, they should leave, and again, not ruin it for everyone. I wish someone would be daring enough to create replacement subs, with all the displaced redditors it would be an easy void to fill, and maybe when this tantrum is over there won't be any need for them to come back. I'm telling myself that I'm going to leave all these subs that have gone private, that'll really show em, but then I wouldn't have anything to do here, I'll leave and the blackout will have worked, I'm just tired of protesters that affect the day to day of us political pawns, I'm just trying to unwind. If you've made it this far, thank you for donating your time reading my rant, I hope it was everything you dreamed of, and then some. Please tell me where I'm wrong. You are not wrong 100% accurate to make comparisons to a petulant child because that's exactly the way many are acting over this. Deleted. Seven years is an eternity in business. Reddit is hardly the same now as it was then. As someone who uses Reddit casually, this is just an all around bad situation for me. Like. I just want to browse stuff but 90% of reddit is dark so I can't. Like come on. I honestly could care less about the policy changes, and I really don't care if I'm a customer or a product, I literally just want to look at stuff. And now most of the subs that I visit regularly are blacked out. I'm being dragged into this protest even though I don't want to be part of it. Edit, I no longer hold this opinion. I'm keeping it up because I don't think it's good to erase past mistakes. This. I literally cannot care about anything less. While I'm a strict desktop old reddit user who will continue to sing its praises over any kind of app be that official or third party. Two days of self imposed downtime will accomplish nothing. It's a pointlessly performative gesture at best. Make it indefinite like what our videos is doing. And yes, Ask Reddit should take part. Deleted. My opinion. I approve. Should this sub participate? Yes. Nuff said. It's stupid as hell. Most PPL use Reddit to find information but now we can't cause these communities are sticking it to the man when in reality they are just inconveniencing people trying to fix issues around their house etc. My suggestion, which will not be read since it is too far down as subs should just post links to reddit alternatives those two days. Shutdown is cool and all but how about offering alternatives? I see you. I think that's a good idea. It's stupid so so stupid the mods just want to feel powerful like they normally do who uses third party apps for reddit anyways just use the regular app you nerd no need to make the subreddits private. I have no idea what is going on. Didn't know there were other apps available. Visually impaired redditor here. I'm quite affected by this matter and I would hope our ask reddit would believe in access for all. Apollo seems to have less than a million users based on the API usage numbers given by the developer. The other apps have said they have similar metrics. So between all the apps. There's maybe a few million users who aren't using the official site or official app. I hope it'll send a message, but given the numbers I believe Reddit is going to gamble on losing hundreds of thousands of users. What really needs to happen is a mass exodus like what happened to Dig. It could happen, 
but everyone needs to find a new site that they all want to go to. Even though I use no third party apps, I still will be striking because of what the damage will be to users who have accessibility issues and rely on third party apps to be able to use Reddit at all. Reddit basically told visually impaired users tough shit, I think many who don't use third party apps will follow suit in solidarity. Probably should participate. This sub gets boring with all the exact same sex posts and slight variation of a popular post that's been asked 3 days before. Give some people time to think of an actual question. Ask Reddit has done a blackout for much smaller issues before don't care in the slightest. Dor in the face technique, https colon slash slash en dot wikipedia dot org slash wiki slash door dash in dash the dash face underscore technique closed bracket dart. After the blackout, Reddit will capitulate and drastically reduce the API fee, which still heavily impacts the app developers, but the user base will celebrate and shout we did it. See while Reddit gets a new revenue stream where they wouldn't have otherwise. Even if a nominal API fee were suggested, it would have been rejected outright. The goal wasn't to create this massive revenue stream, the goal was to create another additional revenue stream, and then minimize the user backlash while conditioning us to accept the original proposal they had in mind. It's all bullshit, and I say tear the whole fucking thing down. Close all the subreddits permanently, let the mods accept that their fiefdom is over, and just move it all somewhere else. Reddit is just circling the drain at this point with the huge bills they have to pay for the VC money they tied up to give us shitty avatars and NFTs we didn't want in the first place. Deleted.